BH haul. So um, I wanted to share with you guys and I wanted to show you what I got. So the first thing that I got was this, the concealers. And I thought it was going to be a little bit bigger, but I am really, this is how they come. I'm, I'm really happy with them. And they have their protective sheet on there. And then you have here, let me see if I can move you up. Okay, there. You have your regular, like, um, nude colors right here to camouflage, the dark one. Then you have the salmon, the yellow, and the green, of course, for redness and dark circles and all that stuff. So I thought this was really cute. You could um, take it in your purse and touch up. So this is what I got. Another thing that I got was um, the foiled eyeshadows. Everybody's talking about them, saying that um, they're dupes for the Makeup Geek one. I don't own any Makeup Geek um, makeup, to be honest, but um, I am planning on ordering some just because I did. Um, I do like these eyeshadows, and um, I wanted to see the difference. So these are the eyeshadows, as you can see, let me move out, these are the eyeshadows, and um, let me switch some, let me move the box. So for example, I know the camera looks like um, light blue, but it's really a dark blue, as you can see here. And I know the camera doesn't do justice for it, but just look at the pigment. This purple one right here is a dark purple. Um, turquoise. Which other one? Gold one. I just stuck my my nail in that. So, um, this is this copper. So they're really pigmented. And, um, I do recommend them. Um, you do, you would have to put like a base underneath. Um, I used them the other day, um, with, um, a white base, the one from Nick, the milk. And they were, they lasted the whole night and, um, I liked them. I really, really liked them. So if you like glitter, cause they're not glitter, but they're like shimmery. Um, yeah, you're going to like this palette. And I like the fact that you're able to see the color. Um, you're able to just, like, look at the palette and see if this works for you. If not, you put it back in your drawer, wherever you put your makeup. And I like that. And it's sturdy. It's sturdy plastic. So, so I liked it. Another thing that I picked up was this. This is the Sculpting Blending, um, 10-piece brush set. And the reason why I got it was because of this one. I wanted to try it out. So they come packed like that. In a plastic bag. And they're full pieces. They look back. Um, taking them out. And they have some, like, they have like a certain, certain smell to it. Um, I think these are going to shed a little bit, at least for the first time you wash them. They say BH Cosmetics. They have one, two, three. Um, they have the number right here. They're really soft, though. They're really, 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 really soft. But I do have to say, they're really soft. So I have the one, two, three. Then this, I have this angle one. This is the 127. And this is for like, um, to sculpt your contour. I have this one right here. This one's the 124. And this would be like a brush to like set your concealer to put on powder. 
then I have the 125. I would probably use this one for my highlight, as you can see. They're really they fall. Then I have the 126 and the 126. I could probably use this one to put your um your blush if you wanted to put it in a certain place and you don't want it to be all over. And then I have the 126, uh, a blending, not a blending brush, but like a, a packing brush, a flat brush, you can say. Really, really soft. I like it. Or you could even use it to blend. I would probably use it to blend your concealer because it's really, really packed. To blend your concealer. Let me see what else. Okay, here's the flat brush. The flat brush is the 130. Then here I have the 132, and I would use this one for your inner um, inner eye or your um, tear duct for the highlight there. And then I have the 129, and the 129 is similar to where is it? To this one, to the one. The 126. And the 129 is the small rounded blending brush. And then this one is the unique one that made me buy the, the, the set. It's like this. And this is the 131 and this is the nose, the nose contour brush. So I want to try this out. So yeah, so um... And these are the brushes that came in that set. I'm gonna put them back in the box or the bag because that way I know that I have to wash them or else I will forget. Okay, so that's that. And another set that I got was this one right here, and I wanted it because, um. Of the containers. Well, I wanted the brushes, so I wanted the containers so that way I can put them in my the brushes with my clean brushes. Okay, and it comes like this. It has a design. It's a nude color. It says BH Cosmetics. Cosmetics. Oh my God! I can't speak today. And this is what it looks like. These are the brushes. The container. So you can set them up like this and put them in there. These are the brushes that I come with. Twelve brushes as well. And um, this one, the way that these come is they have the name. I don't know if you can see that. It has a name and then it has a number. So they're pretty much the same. Um, this is number 11 and it's like a pencil brush. This is number 10 and it's an angle brush. Um, this is number 12 and it's like an eyeliner brush. Um, I would probably use it for my eyebrows. Uh, this is number eight, and these are really soft too. And this is a round blending brush. Um, this is number six and number five, and these are like concealer brushes to apply your your foundation or your concealer. I have here number nine. And number two, and these are like round blending brushes, different sizes. Number four, an ink brush. Number one, a brush, blush brush. Oh, they're really, really, really soft. 
number three. It's like a up. What's it called? Um, face brush. And this is number two, and this is a, like a flat top puffing brush. Really, really, really soft. So, this is everything that I got from BH Cosmetics. And um, you can go ahead and look at the link down below if you want to go ahead and check them out. I'll go ahead and have the name of everything that I purchased.